Okay, we're going to take a look at using this tire machine to take a steel wheel off. Now this type of wheel uh, has usually a hub cap on it, so you can't see the steel part, but if you take a hub cap off and it's metal behind that, you can use this machine to take the tire off. If it's an aluminum wheel, you want to use the machine inside the shop, which is designed to do both steel wheels and aluminum wheels. First thing we're going to do is uh, we're going to use the weight hammer and take the wheel weights off. So if you see any wheel weights on the tire, you want to hook the back here where the little hole is and you're going to kind of peel it off. Squeeze the tool and peel that off. I'll look at the other side in case if you see any weights. I'm going to take them off. Okay, so again, this little hole here, you want to take this part of the tool and put it inside that hole and squeeze this. And just kind of peel it off like that. You can reuse these, so we just kind of save them on the machine. Next thing you want to do is take the air out of the tire. So we're going to take uh, the little core inside the valve stem out. We're going to use this tool here. Okay, this is a tool to take the uh, valve core out. So we're gonna go down inside here and unthread this. You wanna put your finger and your thumb, index finger and your thumb over the valve. So when it comes out, there's under air pressure. You wanna catch it so it doesn't fly out. Okay, and then you can kinda of grab it like that. You're gonna reuse this also. So you wanna save this so you don't lose that. All right, the air comes out of the tire. Um, next thing what we're gonna do is we're gonna hook air to the machine. So we need an uh, air hose. We're gonna pull this coupler down like this. And there's the connection on this machine. We're gonna basically connect these two together. Got a little, little leak there, but seems to be all right. Okay. Now we have to mount the tire on the machine. The way it's gonna work is the center hole of the tire is gonna go over this part, and this part that sticks up with the pointy part goes into one of the lug nut holes. So we're gonna pick up the tire. So one of these lug nut holes here. So we're gonna pick up the tire, mount it right on here, and you can see how that, that comes through one of the lug nut holes. It doesn't matter which one. Now, what we need to do is secure the tire to the machine. We're going to use uh, one of these cones, and we're going to basically thread this down right here. Now, you want to make sure this is tight. So what I usually do, there's two ways you can do this. You can take this and just kind of give it a hit right here, like that. That makes it nice and tight. Or you can actually put this part. So, uh, all right, so that's the way you're going to do it. Hit it like that, make sure it's nice and tight. Okay, next thing we're gonna do, this tool goes in that opening when you're not using it. This part here is gonna do the bead of the tire, just move the bead away from the rim. So you're gonna lift this part up, you're gonna move this around, and you're gonna put this right on the edge next to where the tire rubber part of the tires. You don't want to go on the rim or it'll crush the rim. Now on the other side, if you look over here, there's this metal part that comes up and does the other side of the tire. You don't want to have your hand anywhere in this area here. You can move back when you're using this machine because it's going to hurt your hand. Okay, so what you're going to do is you put your hand on this, this handle. We're going to step on this pedal right here and watch what the machine does. Okay, so see how it kind of squishes it down and it kind of separates the bead on both sides. Then you take your foot off the pedal and lift that up. Okay, then you can move this out of the way. Make sure it's separated all the way around. This one is. Okay, next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna use this tool that we stored in the machine. We're gonna use this end first, not this end. This is to put it on, this is to take it off. This end. Okay, this is how you use it. We're going to basically, this part's going to sit on that part of the machine like that. 
So what you have to do first is we're going to take a look over here where the tire is. You're going to have to push down and move, move this inside here, kind of like that. And you're going to peel the tire over while pushing down on the other side here. So you're going to push down on this side and peel this over like that and lock it on the machine just like that. Okay, then you're going to take your hand and hold this down and step on the pedal while you're lifting up on the tire in this area right here. So watch what it, what it does when I step on the pedal. Okay, so it basically separates the top beam. Okay, then we're going to do the other side. Okay, so you have to tilt the tire out like that. You're going to use the same end. You're going to go all the way down to the other side. Lift this up like that, peel it over, hold this down, lift up on the tire, and step on the pedal. Okay, next thing we want to do is we're going to lubricate the tire. We're going to reinstall it. 